often people just say you just have to put your house up for sale and it's gonna sell. Although this is true, the question is, is it gonna sell for the most money? Hey everyone, my name is Lawrence Mack and I'm a real estate broker out of Mississauga. I'm here to talk about four secrets to selling your home for the most money. Secret number one, more buyers means more money. The typical process that a buyer uses is they're sitting there while watching Netflix or in bed and they're swiping through a lot of pictures. If the picture's no good, then that buyer's lost forever. So we make sure that we use professional photographers so that your house is going to be picked for the short list to be looked at that weekend. And that's why more buyers will get you more money. Secret number two, emotions will get you more money. In commercial real estate, only the numbers matter. But in residential real estate, evoking high emotions will get you much more money. To prepare the home, you want to declutter, depersonalize, and fix things that are broken. The next step is staging. A lot of people make the mistake here of staging just to fill the space. But there's a lot more than that. We hire professional stagers and designers to make the home look like a hotel or maybe a magazine shoot. You want the home to be so pretty that the buyers not only love it, but they just need to have it and they'll pay whatever they need to to get it. And that's why more emotions will get you more money. Secret number three, more experience will get you more money. Did you know that in 2020, the average realtor in Toronto sold only one or two homes? The question is, why would you want an inexperienced realtor to sell your most important asset? I've been at the negotiation table many more times than the average realtor. And that's why more experience will get you more money. Secret number four, pricing your home right will get you more money. There are two pricing strategies to use to sell your home. One is to anchor it at a high price, and the other one is to set up for multiple offers. A lot of it depends on the research, such as the absorption rate or the number of sales in the area. If you price it too low, you're not targeting the right type of buyers. And if you price it too high, you're not gonna get enough buyers that come in. And that's why pricing your home at the right price will get you more money. My name is Lawrence Mack, and I'm a real estate broker out of Mississauga and I help buy and sell homes across the GTA.